Spotlight, presented by Community Health Network. Welcome back. Almost 90,000 people will be told they have lymphoma this year. It's a cancer that targets your white blood cells, and many patients can be cured with a combo of chemo and immunotherapy. But there are some people that this doesn't help. Now a new therapy is giving them another chance, possibly their last chance of being cured. News 8's Brittany Noble has details in today's Health Spotlight. I'm pretty partial to the uh, Nicaraguan Romeo. John Bell is a cigar aficionado, valuing not only just the flavor, but the connections of Stogie Fosters. I once heard somebody describe cigars as the great cementer of friendship, and I think that's, that's true. But after 24 years, his part-time hobby working at the cigar shop was threatened. I was noticing some swelling in my cervical lymph nodes on the left side right in here. John was diagnosed with large B-cell lymphoma, an aggressive cancer of the lymphatic system, and underwent six months of chemo. I was pretty devastated when we got to the end and found out it wasn't completely successful. Hematologist oncologist Natalie Grover at UNC Health believed CAR T-cell therapy would be his best option. It's using a patient's own immune cells to specifically target them to a marker on the lymphoma cells. Their T cells are now specifically targeted to attack their cancer cells. Side effects were harsh. John's temperature pushed 106. His blood pressure dropped. He spent 18 days in the hospital, but a month later. The hope is that he's cured I, with lymphoma. <laughs> now John is back in the cigar shop, savoring each and every moment. I feel good. I have, I'm completely asymptomatic. And it's almost like it never happened. I'm Brittany Noble for Wish TV, wishtv.com, or follow us on Facebook for updates.